race for the White House now two hits for Hillary Clinton overnight. Bernie Sanders winning the Democratic caucus in Wyoming. That would be his seventh victory in the last eight contests. And of course, that big SNL swipe overnight. ABC's Mary Bruce is here covering it all. Hey, Mary, good morning. Hey, good morning. Well, Bernie Sanders is on a roll this morning and bracing for a long battle ahead, now vowing to take the fight all the way to the Democratic convention. The Clinton campaign is getting very nervous. This morning, Bernie Sanders says Hillary Clinton is feeling the burn. With yet another victory under his belt, Sanders is looking ahead to a fight at the convention. No question in my mind that we have the momentum. At least on Saturday Night Live, that momentum doesn't seem to phase Clinton. I have not won a state in almost three weeks because that was the plan. I didn't want to win those. If Clinton does not clinch the majority with pledged delegates before the convention, Sanders is planning to contest her nomination. Last time I checked, about 220 or so pledged delegates ahead. So. We are, we are on the path to the nomination. Overnight, Sanders highlighting the key to his strategy, winning big here in his native New York. If we win here, if we beat Secretary Clinton, are we going to win? All right. The candidates now locked in a fierce battle for the delegate rich state. Visiting a Brooklyn diner, Clinton was asked about Sanders, but she didn't bite, opting for a bite of cheesecake instead. I'm talking cheesecake. <laughs> cheesecake. <laughs> now Sanders is closing in on those pledged delegates. He has about 45% of them so far, but Clinton is still in the lead with 55%. It's an uphill battle for Sanders, but Dan and Cecilia, his campaign this morning is feeling confident. They are. All right, Mary, thank you.